Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Fire Red. Last time we finished up our events on the SSN, we defeated our rival, healed the captain, got the HM01 cut, and came out to Diglett's cave and we caught ourselves a Diglett. Today, we're gonna go on round 11. Just gonna train a tiny, teeny bit. You know what? Change, change that. We're not going on this route. We're just gonna go take on the the gym leader, Lieutenant Surge. So we caught that Diglett for this very specific reason to teach it. Cut. Diglett wants to learn cut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're just gonna be our slave, okay, Diglett? Yes, one, two, and poof, and. Take a learn cut. There we go. Okay. This tree looks like it can be cut down. Would you like to cut it? I would indeed. Diglett, use cut. Alright. Yo, champ in the making. Lieutenant Surge is a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American. He's an expert on electric type Pokemon. Bird or water type. It's flying and water type, not bird. Pokemon match poorly against the electric types. So beware of paralysis too. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. He's locked himself in, so it won't be easy getting to him. So, first thing we should do is take out all these guys. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. That's why I joined this gym. All right. So there are three trainers in this gym. Hmm. Seems to be a pattern. One for the first. Two for the second. Three for the third. Let's see if that pattern continues. Shall we? But we can easily take these guys out with our Charmeleon Alpha. He does a hefty chunk to them. Alright, there goes that Voltorb. Oh, Magnemite. Steel and electric. So. He'll be weak to fire. He should probably get close, if not taken out. There we go. 400 experience for that. Bailey fried. Let's take this sailor guy out. This is no place for kids. Not even if you're good. I'll show you just how good I am. Sailor Dwayne. Pikachu. that number. Ooh, close. Oh gosh, I hate Thunder Wave. Oh well. Oh, gosh. Why are you using Quick Attack? I'm slower than you. Yes. 31. The only way Mr. Purple can get paralyzed is through abilities and non-electric type moves, so like Stun Spore, Body Slam, but not by Thunder Wave, because he's hard round when he evolves. And... <laughs> of course. You dead. Wow, surprised me. Good. You're knocked out now. Did a deal. Did a deal. Oh, I forgot to switch. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my strict commander. He was a hard taskmaster. Isn't that what CO is, commander? Or colonel? I'm not sure. I don't know army titles. Ember? Oh, no! So, double team is like the same thing as, um, smokescreen, except you 
you are dodging instead of lowering their ability to hit type of thing. It uh, changes it just as much. If you use a smoke screen, you have this much less chance to hit them. If they use double team, same thing. That that same chance of missing. Alright, so the trick to this gym, you have this electric field that you can't get by, and there are switches hidden in these 15 trash cans. You have to go and inspect them. Nothing here, nothing here, nothing here, nothing. Nope. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay. When you find one, any of the up to four trash cans directly adjacent, so this one, this one, and this one, will have the other switch. And you know how I checked this earlier and it said that there's nothing in here? Well, it kind of resets and the switch can be in here. So we just flipped the first switch, the first one's off. Oh, we found the second one, first try. Pulling on Twitch TV right there. All right, um, let's... Uh, we have the tradition of just going for it, so let's just go for it. Hey kid, what do you think you're doing here? You won't live long in combat, not with your puny power. I'll tell you kid, electric Pokemon saved me during the war. They zap my enemies into paralysis, same as I'll do to you. We go battling Lieutenant Surge holding a golden Pokeball. Just notice that here goes the Voltorb. Well, here goes Alpha. Let's go for a number and half at least. Good. Sonic Boom does uh, 20 hit points of damage regardless of level. Dragon Rage, same thing except 40. Alright, sending out this Pikachu. Ember. Oh. oh, come on. Not again. Oh, come on, come on. Oh my gosh. Hit him. Shockwave. Selective type of attack, fairly weak, but it will never miss. Oh yeah, one shot. Alright, his last Pokemon is a Raichu. Pikachu's evolved form in one of the hardest Pokemon at this point in the game to fight. Oh no. Hit it. Dang it. This is going to be an annoying fight. Ugh. Please, just, just hit it. Good, 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 good. Get a burn, get a burn, get a burn. Yes! Oh my gosh! Whew. This is a guaranteed win now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get another burn. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Hit it. Hit it. Good. Get a burn, get a burn, get a burn, get a burn. Surviving, get a burn, get a burn. We'll just kill it. Don't miss. Or be fully paralyzed, you can take... Okay, never mind, you can't take that. <sighs> Alright, Mr. Purple. It's up to you. Double kick. Oh, okay. We just won. Of course, you get the crit the second time. Whatevs, whatevs. We win, we win. We got this. We're the best. 
Finally, we beat a gym leader on the first try. Now that's a shocker. Pun intended. You're the real deal, kid. Fine, then. Take the Thunder Badge. 2100. It's, I think it's the highest level of their Pokemon times 100 is how much money you get. The Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon speed. It also lets your Pokemon fly lightning quick anytime, kid. You're special, kid. Take this, kid. Get this. Yeah, kid. Blah, 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 kid. Blah, 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 kid. Shockwave. Teach you to unleash your Pokemon, kid. See ya, kid. Get out of here, kid. I hate you, kid. Ooh, that was an electric match. Oh, the puns. Alright. We took him out. Let's check our Pokedex really quick. How many Pokemon have we caught? Six. Alright. Not bad, I guess. But you weren't there before. Oh, hello, Mona. How are you doing? It's me, one of Professor Oak's aides. Did you meet the other aide? He had a package from Professor Oak for you, Mano. He said he'll look for you on Route 2. Alright. So, we should go to Route 2, but before we get there, we should catch a couple Pokemon. We should, uh, increase our owned Pokemon to 10. I think that would be ideal. So, we'll go to the Pokemart, and we're gonna buy some more balls. Hi there, I want to buy... Give me... 15 Pokeballs. i uh, make it 18. So I have a solid 20. Alright. So let's, um... Let's go catch some Pokemon. Let's go up in here. See what has to... Oh, you know, we, we do have that old rod we can use. Ooh, a Meowth. Let's catch a Meowth. Bag and throw a Pokeball. One, two, three. Gotcha. Boom. So we've got seven. Let's uh, let's catch a Magic Card. Why not? It's on the grass. That's funny. Alright, um... Let's use another Pokeball on that. This will put us to eight. One, two... Aww. Oh. Splash is Magikarp's only attack until level 15 when it learns Tackle, and then 30 when it learns Thrash. Or Flail, sorry, Flail. And Splash cannot deal damage, so it's pretty tough to train a Magikarp early in the game until you get a the item called the Experience Share. But it's still pretty tough. Come on, stay in the ball. Oh my gosh! Stay in the dang Pokeball. One. Two, three, good. Boom. Got the magic card. Cool beans. It's virtually worthless, worthless in terms of both power and speed. It is the most weak and pathetic Pokemon in the world. What a heartwarming Pokedex entry. Isn't it? Hmm, Pidgey. We'll catch this too. Bag and Pokeball. One, a two, a three. Ugh. How many takes does it take to catch a Bigby? The world may never know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, one more poke. Something we haven't seen yet? Let's, um, let's, let's go in the grass over here, but let's not fight anyone. 
I want to save these guys for later. So we can come in this grass. There we go. Ekans. Let's go back and catch this guy. And then this should be 10 Pokemon. One, two, ah. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, why did, why did I do that? Okay, good. Spiro. Oh. Ooh, that's a pretty high level Spiro. Go for Pokeball again. One. Two, three, gotcha, got, got, gotcha. No nickname. All right, so let's check how many Pokemon we have. Ten. Good, we've got ten. Um, now before we go find that Professor Oak's aid on uh, the second route. Let's let's trade that Spearow. We saw that that girl wanted the Spearow for a Farfetch'd. I mean, we're not going to use the Spearow, so if we trade it, we'll just add a page to our Pokedex. So, might as well. Thank you for waiting. All right, let's move our Pokemon around. Take you. Put you. Uh, whatever, 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 whatever. Ooh! Did you guys see that? The Meowth that I just put in the PC is holding a nugget. You can sell those things for 5,000 Poké Dollars. That's more than twice that I got from the gym. I like that. I would, actually. Thank you. So the way in-game trades work, like this, are you trade Pokemon for whatever they're offering, and whatever level the Pokemon that you traded is at, so in this case 17, you receive the Pokemon at that same level. So you could trade a level 5 Spearow and get a level 5 Farfetch'd. You could trade a level 100 Spearow and get a level 100 Farfetch'd. Its name is Shading from Elisa. And there we go. We just added one more page to our Pokedex. Not bad. Not bad. Thank you. No problemo. And it's holding its signature item. Called a stick. Just stick. It's an adamant nature too. It's pretty good. Um, it just ups its attack, I believe. Or its ability to hit consecutively. Not sure. Uh, but, you know, I think we've been going for a decent while now, so we're going to call it here. Next time we're going to go into Diglett's Cave, but thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it very much. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like. If you really enjoyed it and you want to see more, feel free to subscribe. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.